Introduction The Power of a Captivating Essay Written by Marie Forleo from Marie TV Have you ever read an essay that completely captivated you? One that drew you in from the first sentence and left you wanting more? That's the power of engaging writing. Whether you're writing for school, work, or just for fun, the ability to craft compelling essays is an invaluable skill. Engaging essays have the power to inform, persuade, and inspire your readers. They can make complex ideas accessible, spark meaningful conversations, and leave a lasting impact. But how do you write an essay that truly resonates with your audience? It all starts with understanding the key elements of engaging writing. What do you find most challenging about writing introductions? Grabbing attention hooks that reel readers in. You've probably heard the saying, you never get a second chance to make a first impression. Well, the same holds true for essays. Just like meeting someone for the first time, your essay's introduction is your opportunity to make a lasting impression. Your introduction is your chance to grab the reader's attention and make them want to keep reading. It's the gateway to your entire piece, setting the tone and context. One of the biggest challenges writers face is crafting introductions that are both informative and engaging. It's a delicate balance to strike, but it's crucial for keeping your audience hooked. It's easy to fall into the trap of writing dull, generic openings that fail to pique the reader's interest. These uninspired starts can make your reader lose interest before they even get to the heart of your essay. But fear not, there are plenty of techniques you can use to hook your audience from the very beginning. Whether it's starting with a compelling question, an interesting fact, or a vivid anecdote, the right hook can make all the difference. Many people struggle with starting their introductions in a way that is both informative and engaging. It's a common hurdle, but with practice and creativity, you can overcome it. It's easy to get stuck in a rut of writing introductions that are too general or too specific. Finding that sweet spot where your introduction is just right can be challenging, but it's essential for drawing your reader in. What are some of your favorite ways to start an essay? Do you prefer to begin with a thought-provoking question, a surprising fact, or perhaps a personal story? Experiment with different techniques to see what works best for you and your audience. Remember, the goal is to make your reader curious and eager to read more. A strong introduction sets the stage for a compelling essay, so take the time to craft it well. Happy writing! Building a strong foundation crafting coherent body paragraphs. Some popular ways to start an essay include using a surprising statistic, asking a thought-provoking question, or sharing a relevant anecdote. These techniques grab the reader's attention and set the stage for your argument. The body paragraphs are the heart of your essay, where you develop your ideas and present your arguments. This is where you delve deeper into your topic, providing evidence and examples to support your thesis. Each paragraph should focus on a single main idea, expressed in a clear and concise topic sentence. This sentence acts as a guide for the reader, indicating what the paragraph will discuss. Think of each body paragraph as a building block, carefully stacked upon one another to create a sturdy and impressive structure. Just as a building needs a strong foundation, your essay needs well-organized paragraphs to support your argument. To ensure your body paragraphs are coherent and engaging, it's crucial to focus on three key elements, topic sentences, supporting details, and transitions. Supporting details provide the evidence and examples that back up your main idea, while transitions help to connect your paragraphs smoothly. By mastering these elements, you'll be well on your way to crafting essays that are both informative and enjoyable to read. A well-structured essay not only conveys your ideas effectively, but also keeps the reader engaged from start to finish. How do you typically structure your body paragraphs? Do you start with a strong topic sentence, followed by supporting details and smooth transitions, or do you have a different approach? Reflecting on your writing process can help you identify areas for improvement and make your essays even more compelling. Topic sentences, setting the stage for success. There are many different ways to structure body paragraphs, but one common approach is to start with a topic sentence, followed by supporting details and evidence, and then end with a concluding sentence that links back to the main idea. This method not only organizes your thoughts, but also guides your reader through your argument or narrative seamlessly. Imagine walking into a theater with no stage lights, no set design, just a bare stage. The emptiness can be overwhelming, leaving you unsure of what to expect. 
You might be curious about what's to come, but you'd also feel a bit lost. The absence of visual cues makes it difficult to understand the context or anticipate the storyline. That's what it's like for a reader when they encounter a paragraph without a clear topic sentence. They may struggle to grasp the main idea or the direction in which the paragraph is heading. A strong topic sentence acts as the spotlight of your paragraph, illuminating the main point you want to convey. It sets the stage for the details that follow, providing clarity and focus. It should be clear, concise, and directly related to your thesis statement. This connection ensures that each paragraph contributes to your overall argument or narrative. What makes a topic sentence truly effective in your opinion? Is it the clarity, the directness, or perhaps the way it seamlessly ties into the thesis? Think about how a well-crafted topic sentence can transform a paragraph from a collection of sentences into a cohesive, compelling argument. It's not just about stating the main idea, it's about engaging your reader and guiding them through your thought process. So next time you write, remember to set the stage for success with a powerful topic sentence. Supporting details, painting a vivid picture. A truly effective topic sentence is clear, concise, and engaging. It should pique the reader's curiosity and make them want to learn more. Now that you've set the stage with your topic sentence, it's time to bring your paragraph to life with vivid supporting details. Think of these details as the actors, costumes, and props that transform a bare stage into a captivating scene. Supporting details provide evidence, examples, and explanations that back up your topic sentence. They could include statistics, anecdotes, quotes from experts, or even personal experiences. What kind of supporting details do you find most impactful in your own writing? Transitions, creating a seamless flow. The most impactful supporting details are often those that are specific, relevant, and emotionally resonant. They paint a vivid picture in the reader's mind and help them connect with the material on a deeper level. Imagine watching a movie where the scenes jump abruptly from one to another, with no clear connection or flow. It would be jarring and confusing, right? The same goes for essays. Transitions act as the bridges between your ideas, creating a smooth and logical flow from one paragraph to the next. They help your reader follow your train of thought and understand how your ideas are connected. Which transition words or phrases do you find yourself using most often in your writing? Crafting a memorable conclusion, leaving a lasting impression. Some commonly used transition words and phrases include however therefore, for example, in addition, and on the other hand. Just as a captivating introduction draws readers in, a strong conclusion leaves a lasting impression. It's your final opportunity to reiterate your main points, emphasize the significance of your argument, and leave your audience with something to ponder. A weak or rushed conclusion can diminish the impact of even the most well-crafted essay. On the other hand, a powerful conclusion can elevate your writing, leaving your reader feeling satisfied and inspired. What are some common mistakes writers make when crafting conclusions, and how can these be avoided? Bringing it all together. The importance of engaging writing. Common mistakes and conclusions include introducing new information, simply summarizing the essay without adding insight, and ending abruptly without a sense of closure. In today's fast-paced world, where we're constantly bombarded with information, the ability to write engagingly is more important than ever. Whether you're crafting a social media post, a business report, or a personal essay, your writing needs to capture attention and hold interest. By mastering the elements of engaging writing, from crafting captivating introductions to building coherent body paragraphs and ending with memorable conclusions, you can elevate your writing and make your voice heard. What aspects of writing do you find most enjoyable or rewarding? Your turn, share your thoughts and experiences. Many writers find the process of brainstorming, researching, and organizing their thoughts to be the most enjoyable aspects. Others revel in the satisfaction of crafting a particularly elegant sentence or finding the perfect word to convey their meaning. We've covered a lot of ground today, from the power of a captivating introduction to the importance of crafting a memorable conclusion. Now it's your turn to share your thoughts and experiences. What resonated with you the most? What are your biggest takeaways from this essay? We'd love to hear your insights in the comments below. Want to dive even deeper? Take our short survey on engaging writing and let us know your thoughts. 
link to survey. We can't wait to learn from you and continue the